Hi, it's Alicia and I'm here to talk you through my Christmas layout. I made this for the Uniquely Creative September kit. It's a very clean design and takes just one photo but you could easily change it to have multiple photos if you wanted to. Start with a piece of 12 by 12 white cardstock and we're going to adhere the barcode strip from the combi paper. Then we're cutting a 2 inch strip from Holly Jolly and we're going to adhere that to the top of the 12 by 12 cardstock. Next take a green sticker strip and adhere that below the red strip at the top. Then cut a half inch strip from the reverse side of the Holly Jolly paper and adhere that below the green sticker. Select your Christmas photo and choose the Santa and the Christmas tree from the collectibles and also the Merry Christmas title from the collectibles. The collectibles in this kit are really really cute and easy to use. Add another sticker strip down the bottom of the layout, this time a red one with the quote on the bottom and then a little bit of pink to the side. I machine stitched along the top there but that's optional, you don't really need to do that if you don't want to. Then we're adding a couple of little tags in, these just create a little bit of interest. I'm using foam tape to adhere those. I decided to put the Christmas poinsettia flower up the top there with a little bit of foam tape. I layer my photograph onto some paper from the kit. It's called Combi Kisses. It's, it's white with a little, a slight check design. It's time to position the Christmas tree into position now. Then I decide the photo needed a little bit of a brighter border around it so I layer it again onto the Holly Jolly paper. I cut the wreath collectible in half and put one half at the top of the page and one half down the bottom. I put this Santa Claus in position and I put some foam tape on the back of my photo but I don't adhere it just yet. Remove some little stars from the chipboard provided in the kit. A couple more tabs for the top of the photograph. I just really love the tabs that Uniquely Creative make in every one of their kits. I find them really useful. They just add a little bit of decoration. Finally I'm ready to position my photo in place. Now I'm up to gluing on the title of the layout. and the stars with the liquid glue. I cover the stars with some of the red glitter glue that was provided in the kit. 
I wanted to do some journaling for this layout so I add some pencil lines and I journal the story to match my photograph. Once I'm happy with it, I go over the lines with black pen. I use some of the twine from the kit to make two bows at the top and the bottom in the wreath clusters. And that is the end of the layout. Thank you so much for watching and have a lovely crafty day.